Here we go guys, it is moving day. I have never been so excited in my whole life. I have lived here for a few Minecraft years now, but today is the day that I finally get to upgrade my lifestyle. I've been saving away all of my diamonds and emeralds to buy a brand new place. And as you can see, this place isn't really too much to get excited about. It's just straight up too small. My crafting table used to be here where these new boxes are. My furnace as well. Got this cooker here which is just going to stay here because I don't need to take that with me. There's not really much room to move and you literally do not want to know what this was for. Regardless, there's... Oh, oh yeah. And this guy pretty much stays there every single day. All hours of the day, he's here little bit freaky so that is why i'm so looking forward to getting out of here and this is where i'm moving to it's got two doors a nice little pathway cacti carpets a full kitchen double bed and it's just so much bigger the only downside is that it's located next to a pretty big laboratory. I'm not sure it's too much of an issue though, as this is a dream house. So I better get packing. Let me just pack up this clock here, as we need to get out of here as soon as possible. I literally cannot wait. And here it is. It looks so much better in person. Let's get in here. I've got my last moving box right here, which just has some odds and bobs in it. So let's just have a look at that. We've got um, some sticks, some wood, some random stuff. Let's put um, some of this up. Let's put a flower up. It's just going to make it a little bit more homely and put these bowls away as well. Because we've got these amazing new... Oh! There's, why is there chicken in here? Oh, well, a house that comes with free chicken is a house that I want to live in. So let's pop um, this in here. That looks amazing right now. I wonder who is moving into my old place. <laughs> Anyway, we need to sort out some of this stuff. That's the side where we put the crafting table. And then what I want to do is go and introduce myself to the neighbor. So for now, I think I'm going to put the crafting table. Oh, there's too many boxes everywhere. Let's just put it here for now. I know that kind of blocks off the kitchen, but we'll sort that out later. But let's go and introduce ourselves to the brand new neighbor. I wonder what they're like. Um, I have no idea who might be living here, as I was obviously only allowed to look at my own brand new house, not the one next to it. And here we are is this it is this it right here this seems like the front door dr treoris's lab i think i'm saying that correctly treoris yeah it looks like it so it seems like we have a doctor living next door to us that is awesome so uh, the doorbell looks like it's here so let's press it and say hi very fancy sounding doorbell anyone gonna come in here let's have a quick peek through the window there's no other windows around so i can't really see where else if anyone's in, I'm pretty sure I can hear someone, though. Just press it again and see if anyone comes to the door. Doesn't seem like it. Maybe, maybe they just can't hear me. It sounds like they're doing some really loud stuff. And to be honest, it is getting a little bit late. Look, the sun is setting on our brand new moving day. And that's probably for the best, as I've got lots of unpacking to do. Then I need to get some sleep on my amazing brand new double bed if i can get through the door here thank you door so let's go out and have a sleep on this once i've finished unpacking these boxes this is going to be a long day whoa what was that i'm trying to sleep here sounds like it's coming from next door that's super loud what is going on there's no one, is there anyone in there? I can't really see anything. I just see a computer, a couple of potion bottles. Nothing really too weird for a lab. Sounds like it's coming from this side. Is there any way I can get in there? I might, I might have something at home in the boxes that I unpack that I can patch together. You see I changed where I wanted to move everything. But regardless, I need to get in here. Ladders. Yeah, ladders should do the trick. Let me just, um, I haven't got much stuff, have I? Let me just quickly patch some of these together. Make some more ladders. Patch them up like this. Shouldn't take too many. Let's just make a, a couple more. 13 should be enough. Let's put these sticks back. Just so I can peek over the edge and see what's going on. I can't believe it. This is so loud. What are you doing in there? Really? I didn't think it'd be this bad living next to a lab. Come on, let's just put this up here. Really want to see what he's up to. What's up here? Let me just take a quick look. to be very quiet. Whoa! Whoa what, what is he doing? There's no way you can keep a dragon like that in a lab. This guy is crazy! And he 
you're keeping me from sleeping. That's so loud. Oh, I need to duck down before he sees me. Oh, goodness. What... What can I do, though? Maybe... Maybe it's just a one-off. I have only been here for one day, so... I guess I'll give him a chance and see what the next few nights bring. I mean... A, a dragon in a lab? I'm pretty sure that wasn't there when I came to view this house and move in. Oh my goodness. That is crazy. But as I said, I'll give him a chance and see what the next few nights bring. Tomorrow is going to be an exciting day anyway. However, I was wrong. Every night brought a brand new sound. Explosions, gunfire, fire crackling, you name it, I had probably heard it. I was getting hardly any sleep and I just couldn't bear it anymore. Oh my goodness, what is it this time? What is going on? Why do you have to do this every single day? What is that? Fire charges? Fireworks I can hear as well. What is, what is going on? Why would you even need to do this? Right, let's go and have a word with him. This is the final straw. I'm coming round, Treoris. I've never spoken to you before, but today is a day we need to finally talk. Come on, open the door. Open the door, buddy. What is he doing? You can see the fire charges from miles off. What is he playing at? He's not even answering the door again. Is he round? Oh. Is that him? What's he doing out there? Huh. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. oh wow, I, I had no idea, I mean I went round here once but he couldn't hear me and all I've been doing right now is moaning about him. Right, that's it then, tomorrow sparks the beginning of a brand new friendship. The sun is shining, and today is going to be a great day. Dr. Treoris, like it or not, I'm coming round to brighten up your life. But to do that, I will need to be a little bit sneaky by crafting a lever to get past his front door. Regardless, it is for the best. Now, I know I have some sticks in here, but I should have some cobbles somewhere. Of course, none in the oven, none in the chicken cupboard. Oh, we have some here. I think we just need one. So let's just grab one and randomly put this back i guess i don't know why this cobblestone in the cabinet i literally have like no space right now but anyway let's get this lever made and i will be on my way by the way crafting tables in the floor great space saving opportunity i need to extend into the roof sometime as well come on then let's go see dr treoris how's he doing oh it looks like he's got quite a lot set up through the little window there i brought my sticks with me randomly i don't need the sticks but i do need the lever and let's just place this bad boy on. And it works. Beautiful. He hasn't really got a good security system in here, has he? Not at all. I guess the security was not having a lever on the front. But anyway, here we go. And how are you doing, Treoris? Um, oh, don't you don't need to worry about that. What are you up to? Can I can I help you? Great. What can I do? Okay, this one over here. It says pull here. Let's see what happens. <laughs> Oh, oh my goodness, that was actually pretty funny, you made a fart machine, that's incredible, what else can we do? Oh, this TNT over here, I'd love to, you know what, Treoris, this could be the start of something awesome. And there you have it, from there we tested mods, machines and more every single day and have become the best of friends. Of course, it's a little bit more pesky now, but that's what we all love about him. If you can learn anything from this, never judge a book by its cover. You never know what you could be missing out on. Thank you so much for watching this video, guys, as I know that you've been requesting it for ages, and I hope that you did enjoy it. If you did and would like to see more animated adventures of Treoris, then please do hit that like button, and if this happens to be the first video that you've seen by me, then please do subscribe to join Team TDM today for daily Minecraft fun. Oh, and I know what you're thinking. What happened to my amazing house? Well, not all experiments go to plan.